Hey guys, what's up? Angus here. Got another unboxing for you guys. I didn't plan to do an unboxing of this. I just decided to. What the heck? Pretty small, pretty simple. It's from Airsoft Megastore. Oh joy. Let's see how awesome this package turned out. reason I got the Sten back here with the uh, British Warper 2 helmet is because the Sten kind of goes along with this. And just to let you guys know, I've had the Sten since it first came out. I, I like the Sten. I bought it. I wasn't one of the people who went, oh, Call of Duty has that in it and bought it. I bought it because I actually do World War II Mills in British. Not a lot of people do British, so it's a pretty cool thing I like. I like basically anything British in it. All my loaded, so our British show. I'm going to stop talking now and get on to the product. Should be a pretty simple video. Comes in this nice little box that cost me $20 shipping. Total, this packaging cost me, I think, like $77. And shipping was at least $20. So it was, I'm not happy about that. And open it up. Packing slips in here. Toss them off to the side. And let's open this thing up. Now inside here, it's where I got the Sten out. We got MP40 magazines by AGM. Full metal. Made in China, it says on the bottom. 50 round. Low cap mags for the Sten. Takes MP40 mags. We got one, two, hopefully the Mega Store didn't screw up on your order. Three. And then we have four and five. Now notice these. This is really nice example of a Mega Store's quality here. This one's packaging is basically destroyed. No quality control at all. They really don't care what they send you. The packaging is really just going to suck on them. So that's, I'm really not pleased. This is the last time I ordered from Mega Store. The reason I bought them there is because these are cheap anywhere else. They're like 15, 18 bucks. Mega Store had them for. $12, which is one thing I will say to Megastore, they have good magazine prices. But as you can see here, their quality control sucks. I know it's a magazine, I know it's nothing to be freaking out about, but I'm still not satisfied. As a customer, I expect to get something that looks like it's relatively new, not all torn up and crap like that. That's why I'd highly advise against purchasing for Megastore. Also, because of their outrageous shipping prices on a little tiny box like this. I understand I'm far away, but how come from other stores it's only going to cost me like 10 bucks to get this stuff shipped out here. So, as you can see, who knows if this is even used. It's probably one they slapped in their gun to make a video. So, that's just been a quick unboxing. A little mini rant there about how unhappy I am with uh, some of the service over at Megastore. If there, uh, people are watching this video, not happy about your quality control, about the stuff I get, and I'm also not happy about your shipping rates. So, AGM MP40 magazine. It's got five of them. Add to that one, that's six. You'll be seeing a World War II Milsim kit uh, loadout video soon. I'm just working on purchasing either, I can't decide, maybe you guys can help me out, either webbing, which is not reproduction, it's actually World War II issue, importing it over from Europe, it's, I believe, around $130. Or just a mag bandolier across the chest, World War II style, that holds eight magazines. So, let me know in the comments, just a quick unboxing, a little mini rant about Megastore. Don't buy from there, guys. Buy from a store, it might be a little bit more, but you're getting 10 times better quality products. Thank you very much for watching.